Hello and welcome everyone to part seven of uh, Your mom dropped by. We had a nice chat. Uh, let's play she on Starfield. Oh, my mom left a note for us. We just met her. Let's check it out. Let's see, where is it? There it is. I was going through a storage unit the other day and I came across something that made me think of you. I know you're important and you're busy, but I really love it if you visited. I miss you. Hello, Mom. Alright. We can't just ignore our mom. We gotta go visit her. We gotta go visit her. I feel like but been waiting while we're life. already here inside Constellation, our constellation, the let's talk to Samco. That doesn't sound crazy, does So we can it? get this expedition started. Hey, Captain. Need help with anything? Besides you standing on... Standing on... Mid-air, no. I don't need no help. I think you might need some help, though. Maybe some gravity shoes? You ready to head out? Yeah, um, let's do it. We're going to Aquila. Anything I should know before we head out to Aquila? Yeah, don't piss off the Free Star Rangers. <laughs> as far as the Collective is concerned, they're judge, jury, and executioner. They're the good guys, but that don't make them any less dangerous. Outside that, just don't be an asshole. Well, I'm not really good at being an asshole. But I could be. If they're an asshole to me, I'm being an asshole right back. Okay, we'll meet you on board your ship. Talk more when we get there. Once we land on Aquila, it's gonna be you and me. So if you want to do any freewheeling before then, Cora and I will just be riding passenger. All right, cool. Everyone in my poker night is going to hear about you. What? Of all the places we've lived, this is my favorite. I'm so confused. I was just about to go to the apartment. Why are they here? I'm very confused right now. Mom says she wanted to talk to us. Let's talk to Mom first. There's just so much to do in New Atlantis. I just got a note, but there's no new uh, dialogue options. Well, one of your old classmates made junior VP at Gal Bank. All right, already Talking with you has made that. my day. I hope you don't mind, but I figured the lodge was just a nat stop away. I just had to see it. Oh, this place is everything talk I can imagine. Do you know I dreamt of joining Constellation when I was a girl? You want to be in Constellation? I have some vids of when I was, um, 12. In my constellation Halloween outfit, <laughs> so <laughs> embarrassing. But I found space so fascinating that there is still so much we don't know. I guess I still find it that way. Don't worry, I'll be exploring every galaxy in this known universe soon enough. I'm gonna make a feel old. I really can't imagine you as a kid. Hey, I'm not that old, dearest. <laughs> But I'll let your father talk before he bursts. I was playing poker with the Dean of Engineering, and he had this collectible revolver framed. And when he heard you were in Constellation, well, we worked together to get the piece clean and restored. No way. She fires beautifully now. We, uh, uh took turns sighting it at the range. I swear, your father was acting like a school kid. <clears throat> As I was saying, may I present to you Sir Malcolm Livingston's personal sidearm. Malcolm Livingston. All the special modifications, just as he left them. He sounds important. He was chair of Constellation about uh, fifty years ago. Ooh. Anyway, it's yours. <laughs> Next force, I shoot. I'll thank you. <laughs> I almost feel like. I don't see some hills on, so I will just say I'll shred right. I hope it keeps you safe. If not, maybe get a good place for it on a mantle. Well, 
We'll let you get back to it, but uh, Miss Noel said we could look around a little first. Cool. Miss Noel, would it be all right if I brought cookies next time? Actually, Mr. Cookies, what type? Ooh, she's I interested. Make a mean snickerdoodle. Yes, I um, think that would be all right. Snickerdoodles are good. Better bring some, bring enough for me. Let's check out this revolver. It's a 1911. I thought it said it was a revolver. 1911 is not a revolver. Okay, so it has two mods on it. Large magazine, high velocity. I'm assuming the bullets fire faster with that mod. That's expected. Uh, it doesn't actually let us pick mods. I have to go to a modding table to actually prove what the mod does. Uh, I put my other 1911 on my ship. When we go back to the ship, I'll take a look at the other 1911 and them. Just got a free 1911. Constellation sounds magical. Yes. That's awesome. Alright, before I hop on the ship and take a look at the, the other 1911, I've got a bunch of items that need to be sold. I filled the sales inventory completely up. My inventory is pretty much filled up as well. Uh, I'm gonna let's uh, keep the bounty on the space suit. Yeah, you can keep that one too. Actually, I'm gonna give this one to her. The bounty on tool. I kinda wanna keep that, I don't wanna sell it. And for companions, all you need to do is give them one ammo for any weapon you give them, and they have unlimited ammo for that weapon. I actually do have 11 millimeter. I'll just let her use that. Hey, kind of breaking my confidence. Oh. The pills are gonna have to wait a little bit for the vendor. 
pull the key after you restock the credits. Oh, there's no place for me to sit down now, do really go inside of our ship and uh, just take a long nap. sure how long it takes to Windows to restock the credits but I know in previous games it took just about three days so I'm gonna go ahead and sleep for three days hey, hopefully the window will be restocked by then everyone's up here with my weapons nobody better not be stealing nothing where's my bed at there it is So we have local time and we have a UT time. I'm curious to know what UT means and what does UT time mean. Oh hi Sam. That's pretty interesting. The UT time is uh, double our time right now. A little bit more than double, but. I think UT could possibly stand for universe time. The time of the whole universe as a whole. And depending on which planet and which galaxy you are in, or you have your own local time. I'm not sure. Sarah, please. Good work dealing with those merchants and free stuff. Alright, hopefully the kiosk has reset it its inventory. I read your report. on the road gun and I'm not gonna be using it. My micro gun I'm keeping that mini gun is amazing. It's suppressed but my other coachman is a lot better than that. Something you need to offload? Train and authority is always by this he has right here for you. It's all we have our credits again. sleep for another three days so I only slept for one day just 24 hours I'm gonna go see if Starfield is a little different than uh, Fallout see if it only takes one day for the vendors to reset their inventory and set three I'm hoping it's only one day They reset the inventories every in-game day. You no longer have to wait three days. That is really sweet. You know, come to think of it, this is the only, uh, other cutter I have found so far. Like I found a bunch of other different weapons. I've never found a cutter before, even just a stock cutter. This is the only other cutter I found was Hello's cutter. Is this the only 
this the only different variant of the cutter you can get in the whole game? Inspect your ship for heat leaks in every couple landings. Don't cause any delays. I have way too much stuff to sell. These kiosks just don't have enough credits in the inventory. I'm constantly going back and forth between my ship and the kiosk. 5,000 credits is nothing when you got a whole inventory and a whole companion's inventory filled of weapons and armor. You said you had something for me. Here, I have something for you. A gift for me? <laughs> oh, you're incorrigible. I picked it up on one of our latest planetary expeditions. I'm more than just an extra gun, you know. I'm just pleased I get to utilize some of my old field collecting skills. It's been a while. Check back with me from time to time after you return from our planetary jaunts. If I pick anything up, it's all yours. Travel to Aquila City. This is Free Star Space. Please hold your current speed and heading while we scan you for contraband. Scan complete. Go ahead and land. when you have a moment. Here. I, <laughs> I picked it up on one... I'm just pleased. Check back with me. Talks are complete. What a nice gift. Oh, it's the Anchor. You're gonna tell me why we're here on Aquila City? All right, we're here. You ready? Because once we get started, I'm gonna be riding your tail until this is over. She stays with the ship, usually. Got a few more years to go before I let her swill whiskey in some backwater bar. Understandable, though. Let's keep There's uh, something you should know up front. I'm a co. As in Solomon Co., first man on Aquila. That tale I mentioned before, the one I think is connected to an artifact, it's something of a family legend. After Planetfall, Solomon spent years mapping Aquila, and he found a tiny little patch of nothing on his senses. The kind of nothing an artifact produces. He called it the Empty Nest. 
said it was a place even the wildlife of Aquila wouldn't go. Interesting. So Saint Poe, his family were forced to settle in Aquila. Very interesting. Yeah, and the Coers have been coasting on that for ten generations now. Solomon's always a larger-than-life figure if you read the histories, but if you just listen to a few recordings of the man, he was simple. Just wanted to keep moving forward. Because you'll find a whole lot of nothing. Gravitational anomalies are a little hard to pick up in an area with tons of starship traffic. Not to mention all the electronics from the city and security scramblers that the Free Star or smugglers out on the frontier put down. So we found something missed and then the artifact. Solomon's maps are locked up tight in the local Gal Bank. We'll be heading there. What are we raiding a bank? We're gonna rob a bank? Thing just staying. Um, really confused. Here, this is for you. It's not a gift, just a contribution to our cause. I spotted it on our last planetary foray. All part of the service. Hey, I'm gonna pick things up one way or the other. I'll keep my eyes peeled. Some blood, that's pretty useful. So, no way for Marco. He's not following me. I guess I'm on my own to find the Gal Bank. Your habitat screen? That's not a problem. And your screen for the new reactor? It's still under manufactured warranty. Yes. Can I get an invoice? <laughs> what you need one of those for? Corporate policy. All right, now it's falling. Yeah. Out of the walk away from me. You're not going to let me pass, are you? Hold it. By order of Marshal Daniel Blake, I need to inform you we've got some trouble at Gal Bank. Folks might be in danger, so you may want to steer clear. Never a dull moment around here. I know you. You Sam Co. Marshal be damn glad to have another Free Star Ranger helping out. Afraid your information is a couple years out of date. Trouble. Well, all I know is there was an attempted bank robbery and things went sideways. You'd have to ask the marshal if you want the whole story. We were a little late to the bank robbery. I guess that'd be the marshal's call. Frankly, it ain't going well. Looks to be a stalemate. Maybe a little outside help would do some good. Well, I doubt those robbers are gonna let us leisurely peruse the Gal Bank vault. We better see if we can help move this situation along. You stay where I can see you, Marshal. Everyone stay in the front of the building and just be safe. Kilo City. Feels like I spent half my life trying to get out of this place. You planning to tell me your demands at some point? You find someone we can trust, and maybe we will. Like who? Not you, but not one of your rangers, and not these city guards. Uh, how the hell am I supposed to get people with that? Hello. You need to 
to stand back now. Well, they can use some help. I don't mean to be rude, but I don't know you. Now, please, stand back. Aquila City at its finest, I see. Never a dull moment. Well, I'll be damned. Sam Cole. Been a long time. I won't hold my breath about you being here to take the badge again. Uh, listen, Sam, just so you know, I don't blame you for how it went down. For the others, though, you might get a different perception. Thanks. I appreciate you saying so. But I figure some of that reception is owed. Still, I appreciate the sentiment, Marshal. It seems you got a situation. My friend here may be the answer you're looking for. All right, Sam. I'll trust your judgment on this one. Some folks from the Shaw Gang tried to rob the place, but they got spotted by a guard. They took everyone inside hostage, and now they're keeping a watch so we can't move against them. They're using the intercom to communicate. What demands have they been asking for? They won't talk to me. Say they don't trust the badge. <laughs> they want a neutral negotiator. In other words, they didn't have a plan for this, so they're stalling while they come up with one. What's your plan? Without demands, I ain't got much to work with. About all we can do is wait and see. Hmm. All right, I'm willing to allow that. But a few things first. Say what you have to, but whatever they ask for, there's no way in hell I'm giving it to them. Also, there are lives at stake, so don't get cavalier. Find out what they want, and then report back to me. Take it slow and steady. Look for every opportunity to de-escalate. You got this. Hey, you in the bank. I'm sending in a negotiator, so don't shoot. Stand I have complete him. confidence in the marshal. Charity around here is a joke. Save over. You're the negotiator, huh? You think you're just gonna walk up here and get us to surrender? You're dead wrong. I don't even know who I'm even talking to. Uh, it's, it's Jed. Jed Bullock. Good to meet you. <laughs> well, ain't you polite. So tell me, stranger, how do I know you're gonna deal straight with us? No, no way. The trait that sends bounty hunters after me gives me dialogue options, too. That's awesome. I heard that. Okay, so let's talk. I was a hostage that's holding up. They talk too damn much. Complain about everything. As much as we'd like to, none of us have shot one yet. I mean, that sounds about right for a hostage to do. We want to guarantee a safe passage to the spaceport and a ship. We'll drop the hostages off somewhere safe in the city. After that, we'll radio back where they are, and the marshal and his crew can come and get them. But if anybody follows us when we break orbit, we start shooting. I don't know if you'll keep your word. You think we want to stay locked up in here? Hell no! Could take a while to get shit. Oh hell, the Free Star Rangers have got ships. They could give us one of them. This whole damn job's gone wrong. It was supposed to be just a quick hit. Clean and simple, you know? So let's just... 
So I'll try to keep our heads, yeah? Because my guys are going crazy in here. I don't know how much longer we can last. That's all you do to me. You do that. He already said he uh, was not going to give him the demands, but I'm not going to try and persuade them because my persuasion is not so strong. Fools of us all. I heard every word. He's talking too loud. Sign of fatigue. That fear and exhaustion are taking a toll. They're not thinking straight. That puts us in a very precarious position. I wish they would back and talk. Now nah, you'd be wasting your time. Or worse, it'd make them angry. No sense risking that. I appreciate your idealism, but there were only ever two ways this could end. You've already ruled out one of them, so that leaves us with only one option. We have to free the hostages by taking out their captors. Problem is, they're keeping me and the guards in sight at all times. If we try to move against them, they'll see us coming. I got another trade soldier, it's also giving me a unique dialogue option too. Done this kind of work before, huh? Good. I'll feel a lot better about sending in a professional. That sounded kind of cold-blooded. Now, I see two ways we can play this. You could ask to see the hostages. Once you're inside, you can make your move. If you're quick, I think you can take them out before they have a chance to respond. But you'll have to shoot to kill. There's also a back door. Most of their attention's focused out front here, so they may not be watching it as closely. This key should unlock it. I'm sure everything will turn out just fine. What'd the marshal say? We have a deal? No deal with us as hostages. The marshal thinks he can dictate terms now? <laughs> Good thing for you, I'm in a generous mood. You're gonna need to ditch that weapon first. Ain't no way I'm letting you in here armed. I'm gonna try persuading them. So far, do I have any? Both the items and then increase that. There it is. We have a leak there. Like I said. Fine, but make it quick. I'm done talking about this. Now go tell the marshal that I want my goddamn shit. Marshal ain't budging. I'm gonna relieve my save. Let's take that if it looks uh, real quick. You're the negotiator.
ain't you polite. So tell me, stranger, how do I... I heard that. Okay, so let's talk. We want to guarantee a safe pass. We'll drop the hostages off. After that, we'll radio back where they... But if anybody follows us, we'll... Oh, hell, the Free Star Rangers have got ships. This whole damn job's going... Hopefully we can do this frustration. What do you mean? That seems like the best one out of these three. Damn it! I didn't think of it that way. The difference between you and a marshal leaves innocent people out of it. Sometimes bad Let's take a Full potential will be really huh? useful. Okay, so let's. We want a guarantee. We'll drop the hostage. After that, we'll radio back where they are. But if anybody follows us. Oh, hell. So let's just. What do you mean? Might as well let your prisoners go. Then we're not keeping it safe. They're our ticket out of here. So I ain't exactly inclined to let them go. I'm gonna go with the, this one. You have to believe me. We never meant to take hostages. Why don't you want to keep those hostages safe for it takes to let them go before you have to take drastic action against me. I know, I know. Not disagreeing with that. Nobody's been hurt. Get it. We got it. Maybe the judge won't come down too hard on us. Yeah. I think this has gone on long enough. You go tell the marshal we'll come quietly. You'd make a decent ranger with the way you handled that. I would be fine going to the gun police, and, but I know they're going to kill some hostages, and I'd rather not have them die. Those guys are scared. I can tell. What's the word? <laughs> Hope you got a nice reward for me. First things first, how'd you get the Shaw Gang to stand down? <laughs> I can convince them. Considering those are Shaw's people, that's damn near a miracle. Here, you've more than earned this. You got us out of a tough spot, and you did it with courage that's not common. As a matter of fact, you might just be Free Star Ranger material. If you're interested, head on over to the Rock and ask for Emma Wilcox. She handles the new recruits. I'm sure things will turn out just fine. All right. 
Now that lives aren't on the line, let's get back and Galahad, see if we can get those maps. Cool, so we could be in range of everyone. Take it from here. We have finally made it inside of the bay. Nice job. Let's take a look around. Dude, I was yes. To. What? Get out of here. Hate this place. Should have been long gone by now. Shaw Gang's gone too far this time. Galbank needs better security. Oh, that's still in here. I wonder when kick footsteps away from. Stepped up. Very interesting. They have made it extremely hard to steal items in the stall. You can no longer pick items up to steal. Well, they're still stealing it since they can't. Get it out of your inventory, they just want hostile. Where did another one go? They lost three of them. Ah, broad shoulders. Yes, what? Else. I thought these move pads were useless, but they're actually pretty handy. This is, tr this is a lot trickier than this. See me from over here, right? Let's do this everything. This will make a good story. I've had quite enough excitement oh, for now. I don't see no vaults in there. There was the vault. All right. The family has a few different deposit boxes secured in here, so let's look around. Here's a copy of the key. 
Okay, now remember, Solomon was from an earlier generation. You can only so it's not going to be on a steel sorting. Big bundles of paper. What we're after. I'm assuming there's a camera that's looking at you the whole time. Idiot. Alright, let's see. Engaged alien travel bike. It's gonna be worth my water. I'm a little disappointed that I can't open each and every single one of and actually rob the bank while it's being completed. That would be really cool if we could actually do that. I know you and your friends would be able to come plunder your heritage at some point. Want those maps? You know where to find them. Check it. Of course, that old mule saw this coming. Sounds like drama. You gonna be like this the whole way? Damn it. <laughs> I was hoping to avoid the estate. Cora's gonna be so mad. He's tricky. We really gotta do this. No reason you can't tell me who he is. You're not wrong. <laughs> you can't walk together, you don't trust me. I know, it's just... Nice, that was easy. It's personal. <sighs> Alright, fine. He's my dad, okay? We're not exactly on friendly terms. He probably figured I'd come for the maps at some point. Got ahead of me. Family business just wasn't something I wanted to get into, you know? Yeah, well, sorry I'm such a pain about it. No forgiveness between me and my old man. It's, a uh, co-tradition. All right, shall we? That sounds like a really bad tradition. That loading screen took forever. Let's head to the estates. Yeah, Sam called it. Ah, it's Solomon Stone. And to say, my family was on the first floor. That's the rock. Ranger Central. Not a bad part. This is a pretty cool looking city. Yeah. New Atlanta is like a futuristic city, and this is like your average uh, man built city. I, I like the Kula city a lot better. This feels more natural. Private sector. Oh, that's where the real money's at. I'm assuming that's Jacob. Too happy. Sam Cole finally decides to darken our doorstep again. You know why I'm here. Oh? And what's that? Have you come to your senses? Realize where you ought to be for once? I ain't asking again. You ain't asked once. Let's hear it. 
I want you to say the words about what's more important to you than family. Okay, this was a mistake. The only mistake I'm seeing here is you. Bringing your constellation lackey here instead of my granddaughter. Come to help Sam loot his ancestry? You're not getting those manners. Full stop. You were one pissed off old man. I had this for the sort. I'm not saying anything. I'm letting him say anything. Just... I got just as much right to those maps as anyone else in this family. That's exactly right, Sam. We all share Solomon's legacy. Only some of us are around to live up to it, and some of us aren't. All right, that's enough. Come on, let's you and I talk in private. Hmm. Welcome home, Sam. Make your visit short, okay? It's what you do. I'm up for a little adventure. All right, what's up? Give me a sec. <sighs> All right, let's talk options. What about Carla? No, no, no. I mean, this is no place for her, okay? The less time she spends with Jacob, the better. Sounds like he's pretty mad and he can't see his friend not though. I just... I made a decision a long time ago about how my little girl gets raised. And it doesn't include Jacob Cole. Okay? Leave it at that. All right. We can try something else. I'd appreciate that. Yes, I can try talking to him. You're flying in the face of my 30 plus years experience with the man, but all right. I hope you like arguing. Sam's constellation lack you here to bother me again? I'm not gonna distract him, that's just rude. So he doesn't like constellations? You mean besides the fact that you're some independent group that doesn't know where your loyalties lie? Or are you referring to the fact that my granddaughter lives in your clubhouse rather than in her family home? Okay, I'm confused about that fourth part he said about Constellation, but I guess we only got one option, and it's just ready to... Well, that's not your decision, is it? It's called property by birthright. It stays here. Only got four, so what, maybe it'll be easy? Well, it's not your place to butt in. Or maybe not. You think I'm not trying to help him? <laughs> Sorry, but I can't. I'm not flapping my jaw one more second over this. The answer's no. My own father's trying to keep those maps from me. Next time. All right, what's our option now? I'm not gonna distract him and just raid uh, someone else's house. That is not something I'm gonna be doing. We're gonna call her with you later on.
Free Thornton if we get Carl in the freaking see his friend off. He will be more willing to what uh, give Sam his maps. for the better weapons kind of thing. What do you think of Jacob? Grandpa Jacob? Are we going to see him? Dad said no last time. And I'd still be saying no if I had any choice in the matter. And by the way, I thought I told you not to pry. Can we just do this? So is the answer yes? That's usually Dad's way of saying yes. Cora, we need your help at the co estate. Really? Over my strong objections. Works for me. Let's go. Yeah, I know, Sam. You hated that. I'm not stooping around your granddad's house stealing. Some old map because you don't want him talking to your granddaughter. I get it, you got strong reasons for him not to talk to your granddaughter. I'm not letting you distract him while I'm snooping around his house stealing maps. That is not something I'm gonna do. If that's the route you want to go about this, you should have came along by yourself or got somebody else to do that for you. Because that's not something I'm doing. Just one quiet day. <sighs> All right. Hopefully, we have better luck now. Do you see that? Here's just a walking <laughs> head. There's my girl. Look how big you've grown. You should see my right hook now. I bet I could knock you flat on your butt, old man. <laughs> That's the spirit. If only your ancestor Solomon could be here to see how bright the co-future will be. Can we move this along? Uh, don't listen to him, my darling. You should stay here with me during your visit. Co-estate's a much better place than some musty old starship. Can I, Dad? No. She was just popping in to say hi. That's it. You want those maps, Sam? Don't think I don't see what you're up to. She'll be safe here while you're doing whatever it is you're gonna do. Fine. Hand them over. Don't worry about me. Hanging out at the estate is great. All right, cool. We got the maps, and it wasn't even that difficult. But I will still look around his house. Anything good in the fridge? Got plenty of beer and here's some onions. I think some pears. Ah oh, shit. I just touched a container. I didn't even touch the pears, dude. Come on, really. Stoff really got the next level. And they really went all out with the stealing. In this game, you can't even pick up a container with stolen goods in it. <laughs> There's my girl. You can do that by accident. That is so easy to do by accident. Shinjiro, uh, co estate's a much better place than some musty old starship. Can I, Dad? No, I'll pop in to say hi. Got to get a David Copperfield.
Let's just stop all. All right, same. Wasn't really that bad. You just stop glitching out on me for one second. All right, let's see if we can find the empty nest. All right, let me think. The way I heard it, the readings he was getting were normal at first, then they bottomed out. And no creature, alien or otherwise, would dare step inside. There. Found it. Oh, boy. <sighs> That's a problem. That does not sound good. My anxiety really is bad enough. Don't be saying things like that. We'll be fine. Just gotta take a look at what we're up against. First, it's in the middle of the frontier, which we already expected. No problems there, but the usual tussling with alien wildlife. I know, big but deal. But the empty nest is a cave right in the middle of Shawgang territory. Uh -huh. Same outlaws who held up Galbank. How are they surviving outside the walls? Criminal groups in Aquila always find a way. But they usually have to keep on the move to avoid the Ashta. Well, Ash, it could just be a coincidence if the cave we want happens to be where the Shaw Gang runs around. But something doesn't feel right. Um. Something tells me or the way he's talking. Someone, somebody in the Shaw Gang, more than likely, has that artifact. I'm willing to bet you they have the artifact. They better not break to sell that artifact. Hey, if they're willing to trade, all the better. But the Shaw Gang is a uh, shoot first kind of outfit. All right, time's a wasting. Let's get to that cave. All right. So assuming by the one dialogue option by how they survive outside of the walls. They're so alike. I'm assuming the killer city is surrounded in a, a wall of some sorts. It's a little interesting. Finally. These loading screens on Aquila City are no joke. They take forever. So Aquila City, it kind of was more of a medieval approach to building the city. That's really cool. And we got a crop built outside of the walls. That is really cool. Seven hundred meters. Spending time in Hard G is a good workout. I don't need to like it though. Is there a way I could uh, perhaps fly the ship down there? I don't believe there is. Oh, that's so such a long way to walk. This is going to take some time. Got some structures. Nickel and aluminum. Aluminium. Can I read? Oh, Ashta. So an Ashta is one of these alien 
life forms. Oh, that looks cool. Damn. These Ashtas ain't no joke. They almost look like Skags. But they, they can take a beating. Don't, don't mess around with Ashtas. A grazed insightful. Those are some tall, pretty tall aliens. Are they friendly? Doesn't seem like they're attacking me. Get back here. I gotta scan you. Get back here. Just need one more. Back here. Gotcha. I like the giant ma praying mantises. Pretty cool. Insightful. What do we got? Ooh, we got another Ashton. There you go. He's going after the insightful. He just one fighted that insightful. No way. Twenty-five percent of my health. These, these ashes really are tough. Oh, a really close empty nest. I'm just curious, how much damage does a low 15 Ashton do? I have 400 health and it does 25% on my health. An Ashton does 100 damage per strike or per bite. That is insane. That really is insane. All right. Oh shit. Territory. What is up with all the mines? Shaw gang. Really don't like people sneaking around the around the camps. Can't move on the torts against them. Well, those those torts are attacking them now. Nice.
package to where there is. Where are you going? The party has just begun. Don't start running away like hell already. Tombstone. Tombstone. Got a sniper scope on it. All of the Shaw gang members just fled. That is so embarrassing. <laughs> Y'all should be ashamed of yourself. You're letting two armed men take out your whole gang. And you can't even stay stationary and fight. There was too many mines around this camp. Torch shooting, so uh, they've got to be close by. There he is. The tombstone lives up to its name. It will indeed put you in a, a tomb. You will indeed need a tombstone. fight at all. Isn't they had a robot around us somewhere? Let's enter the cave. Shotgun back out. That gun is pretty good, and I want to save the little bit of ammo I have in case I run across a boss. This ain't over. Is there a way I can see the mines before I actually step on them? Alright, 
I saw that one after it, it went off. Mines are pretty hard to see. Thought you could hide, huh? Have a key. We don't have a key or the lockpick. You can just jump right on over the gate. How hard is this? Advanced. I want the XP and the lock picking. Instead of just picking the key up and doing it that way. But yeah, I still need to pick 11 more locks before I can upgrade my skill again. KP right there. Contraband cache. Oh, this one can't be used for anything. single left oh we're having all right these two go for the inner in circle and there's the outer circle bingo still an arc book 15,000 credits Wait, is that six of them? Varun Heretic Writings. Is that five of them or... What does that number mean? That is... So is this valley one or is this all of them? That does not sound like fun. But how can I smuggle and pass them? Every solar system I, or every galaxy I've been to always scans you for contraband when you in, enter it. But well, that's how much one is. And we have six of those. That's like a hundred thousand credits right now. Put that back in there. I will come back later for that once I know how to smuggle them. Ashta Tamal. Randomly deals fire damage. I don't know why it's called an Ashta Tamal. Whoa. That's probably why. Fire damage and explosive damage.
I found a second cuddle, but it's only a regular cuddle. Nothing special about it. This one's empty. That's what there aren't any beasties, the cave can be an explorer's best friend. That's what the mines look like, and that is pretty hard to see if you're just walking around. Not actively looking for mines. I believe the only mistake that was made was you were sneaking up on me. Well, they don't need it. Damn it. This cave is very small. <laughs> So it appears they did not get the artifact. But they were all hiding out in the cave with the artifact in it. I wonder if they even knew it was in here or not. Those visions keep getting cooler and cooler. Idea just popped into my head about the contraband. Smugglers use caves like this everywhere. Sometimes you get lucky and find the damnedest things around. What if companions force the guy to trade with them? Yeah. Won't lie. My heart stopped for later. What if? Won't lie. Can Can't I you find a new pistol? Give my companions contraband. No, it's not an option at all. So long. But um, who who do I sell the contraband to?
Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna take one of these Hitotech writings. See if I lose one of those, it's only 9,000 credits I'm losing out on. That's still a lot, but I'm gonna take one. See who we can or can't sell it to inside of Aquila City without leaving the planet. Can we sell it? Because if we leave the planet, we're gonna get scanned. And then we won't be able to sell it at all then. I think that's far enough. Hate to put a hole in the head of Aquila's own prodigal son. At least not before we've had a word. You must be Shaw. What I am is disappointed. Samco in the flesh and he's peddling around the frontier with the has-beens of Constellation. Now you got past my crew, who I pay quite handsomely, I might add. Grab something from that weird cave. Probably what paying them quite handsomely. So they sure run off a lot. Out. Now, let's talk about what all that's worth to me. Your lives, your credits. One or the other, really. Uh-huh. I have contraband in this cave that I plan on coming back for. You are not taking that, and I'm not giving you my credits. Kill them! Where's that Asta team we're at? Damn it! Just shoot everything! You're gonna really mess with me, Shaw. I don't know about saying, but you do not mess with me. Victor goes the spoils. I said that right, right? A razorback. Where was all the other pussies at? You kill their leader and they all just go running. Hiding in the grass. This gun is by far the best gun I, I've gotten so far. Where is that thing just from? Down Seems like this thing fights studs sometimes. I should have scanned this ash that's if I killed them. I didn't even think about it.
what is that? Masignoth. Masignoth? This thing isn't hostile, is it? No, but this ash does all. I'm gonna increase my medicine. Use healing items six times all units so we don't have to be in combat this time. I'm 
I'm not gonna walk all the way around the city to go to the front door, right? Oh no, there's doors right up. There's doors in the front and in the back. Don't even think about leaving the city. Asta out there. And they are no joke. I already left the city and I came back. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What? Alright, we have an info kiosk. Hitching post, shepherd's store, midtown minerals, stone rooting, load of firearms, trunks, Sinclair books, caribou, stretch, and uh, AGs. Museum. A half day. I talked with Miss Casper and she gives a full guidance. If I get called on one more drunken disorderly. Why are we going back to the ship? Do we have to grab a car up? Just tell me to return on straight back to the lodge. That's a little odd, but okay. My brother in law just got back from two weeks in Paris. Journal store. I doubt I'll be able to sell a conch man to a journal yeah, store, but I'll say let's try. Feel free to look around. Post, which just looks like a food stand. Royal Land Arms. Maybe someone who sells weapons will buy contraband. Sure, Laredo make. You start shooting up the town with something I sold you, I'll be more than a little displeased. I cannot make any promises then, uh, nope. Only uh, weapons and ammo.
Um, might as well take a look. Elegance. That looks like a badass pistol. The price on it though. Max shop. That looks like it's gonna pack a punch. And oh, with all the shotgun. It's a trail gauge. Oh, yawn. It's a laser rifle. No light. The Zapple. Okay. I don't even know what ammo I need. Ascertain with 40 millimeter XPL. I guess I'm an explosive. Micro gun is triple seven. Coachman is case of the shells. Mailstorm is 6.5. I really want some 6.5 millimeters. Oh, I do have some weapons. I, I might as well go and sell. Oh, I'm gonna keep the cutters. Tombstone's pretty good. Oh, that's 11 millimeter. Okay, so the Kraken uses the same amount, of, the same type of ammo as the Milestone. I'm selling the Kraken or keep the Milestone. Six point five millimeter. We have CT, MI, RA, and the whiteout. Radiation hardened. Saw them say that. Yeah. So what is the difference between these? different types of ammo. I don't know. I guess I'll just get the CT because it's cheaper. Four to five calibers. Forty three Ultra AMG. Eleven millimeter. That's really good. Now I don't see the forty millimeter explosives. Okay, that's all we can get right now. You don't need to wear your helmet on this planet. You know that, right? 
Don't tell me what to do. Yep, chunks. Just like a four state place. Midtown minerals. It's probably just a place for selling mine resources. We got terror through there. Sounds like a coffee shop. Keep your nose clean. The last thing I want. Is there a light in the house? Trade authority. I'm really, really hoping the trade authority buys contract. Business with the trade authority? The trade authority is always looking for new opportunities. Just looking around. Oh, can I talk to you? Aquila City is there what brings you to the trade authority. Let's see what you have to so. <laughs> Now you're speaking my language. Please. Please buy this contraband. Oh, I miss. They do, but. Uh, instead of it being worth almost 9,000, it's barely worth a thousand. That's really not even worth the trouble. I'll also go back and get the other one to sell too because that is a. Even though it's only a thousand, it's, that's still a good bit. It's worth saving your data, it's worth a lot more than the Alta Authority. Hmm. Sell your data. No way the dragon of they have the dry dragon of in this game. Oh all hunting rifle. That'd be sweet. I'm buying all the ammo I can. So I should be good for a decent amount of time. I shouldn't have to worry about buying ammo for a while. Use to symptoms of withdrawal until a cure can be administered. Okay. Amp. Gives you plus 45% movement speed and double jump height for two minutes. That'll be really useful out exploring. Healing gel. Severe bonds and frostbite. And uh, on top of that, 150 damage resistance for five minutes. Hill paste does the same thing, just without the damp resistance, and a lot cheaper. Hot plus 200 damage resistance and 20% health. That's pretty good, but I should have a bunch of those. Immobilizer. Trade. 
traits, dislocated and fractured limbs, and torn muscles. Trees, the med packs are expensive. 500 credits for one. Treats infections. And you also get plus 20 oxygen fatigue. That's really not all that old. It was expensive. Monastery percent movement noise for 10 minutes. That's poor for running around stealthing. Red trench. A lot more melee damage. Treats brain injury, concussion, heat stroke, cornea, hypothermia, lung damage, poisoning, and radiation poisoning. And uh, used to purge the body of toxins initially developed as a hangover preventative. Pretty cool. Wish they had more snake oil because I have a problem with getting lung damage somehow. So I'll probably end up using that because it will heal real soon, probably. Okay, we're going back to that cave. We're coming right back here. The trade authority is where we sell contraband. I really need to level up my combo skills so I can start selling things for the price they should be, which I can level that up. I'll probably do that on my next level up, my next skill point. So we can get it up by 25% more selling the max brain. Some smugglers are not bad. Take all that. I do wonder if you can get contraband. By just exploring caves and stuff. What happens if you explore a planet that doesn't have civilization on it, so there is no trade authority on it? How would you go about flying to a different planet and actually selling that contraband? Because every planet in the galaxy that I've been to so far has always scanned for contraband. I'm just gonna assume not every galaxy scans for contraband. I'm just gonna assume. I wonder, can we use this kiosk? This kiosk is the Trade Authority kiosk. Can we sell contraband to the kiosk? No, we cannot. We can't just find a um, the trade authority kiosk. We have to find the trade authority building with the actual NPC vendor to sell to. Another day.
stolen all four this supposed to be worth twenty one thousand or fifteen thousand, but I'm only sell it for two thousand. It's not really good. But I did just need like twenty thousand caps for doing nothing practically. I hope hey, you are satisfied with the Newest quarters of available to you. Through for us. We didn't have to go back for Korra. Has anyone she just came back you herself. You didn't let Korra handle the artifact, did you? We don't know what effect it might have on someone her age. Relax. We're fine. Go ahead. Time for that artifact to meet its siblings. Just, what are we building here? I haven't picked up any kind of frequency or signal coming from it. That doesn't mean much. This thing could be emitting something we can't even detect. As far as we know, we could be building a gigantic bomb that will blow up as soon Lasko, as we finish. Lasko, quick! Top three one-liner moments. Maybe. Yes, some Barrett. Kind of Number three. Tool. Your retort to Why the Crimson Fleet Raiders on Leonis Three. Yes. It's a message. Classic. Number two. Your wisecrack about the Ashta and the Miner to the patrons of the Stone Root Inn. Moving forward sometimes means rolling. fumbling around in the dark. Number one, your counter to the I think Cora and I can use some downtime, but you let me know if you ever want to team up again. Let's know he's not too healthy, man. Oh, and since it tends to come up, me and my Rugrat co pilot work as a team. That's non negotiable. If I'm coming with, that means Cora's on your ship. Dictated. Shall I update That's the likewise? Lady. You know where to find us. If you have a moment, I have something I'd like to discuss. We've so always considered ourselves man. explorers. This really is uncharted territory. Yeah. Go ahead, back out. Yes, yes, absolutely. All right. I mean, we, we have the possibility of acquiring a power from the Wily Epsilon and uh, Castle Repeater 2A. But we also have this. Walter Shroud wants to talk to me. All that money can buy. You can wait. These powers sound a lot more interesting. I want to get some more powers. We have seven undiscovered temples, and we just got two more. As always, please like the video, make sure you like the content. If you want to see future content, please do subscribe. And if you have any feedback at all, sure. please do leave it down in the comment section down below. Hope you all I have an amazing service, day. Captain.